Did you watch? You watch Collision, right? Yes, I did. So this is you know, the, the, you know it's kind of weird. Like they, they they open up, you know, they're coming off like um, Okada on Wednesday night, and you know Osprey was there on Wednesday night. And it's like you know, there's like a lot of things that happen, but they open the show with a um, what's his name? You know, Brian Danielson versus Shane Taylor, right? And I'm like, what's the, what's the point of doing 12 minutes that with with this match? Like, like Brian Danielson needs, needs a like he needs a win. Right. You know, they should have just had it opened up and just had it a verb like a like an in ring with Brian. Danielson. And then, <laughs> isn't it unbelievable? Like every week, people just can't wait to turn off this show, bro. Yeah, bro. This is perfect. Show. This is perfect because some I'm guy. Collision. Listen, let me just say this. Let me, wait, wait, leave it there. It, well, no, that's dynamite. I wouldn't pull collision. Okay, but I just want to say something. Wait a second. Right. So this is perfect because some guy on Twitter sent me a thing where basically it's Willow versus Rio, right. and she's doing like all the work, you know, Willow is, right? Right. Getting into position and all that. And I go, he goes, what do you think about this? I go, I don't think anything about this. The worst thing is, is this was the main event when it should right. have been that sweet six man or Wardlow and Samoa Joe. Look at the number. Look at the number. Of course it was. Of course it was. 27. I, I tweeted. I tweeted. Bro, they started Wardlow. at a million. What a drop. No, no, that, that's a, that's, no, no. They started like 900. 900,000 is the first quarter. That's the first. Yeah, that's the lead in from what it, from they start, or whatever. Or yeah, they start three minutes after Big Bang. Somebody still watching Big Bang. You had that that you right. know, it's, it's a false lead, right? They're, they're it's false, the but the numbers there, so it started right. at a million. Right, but uh, to finish the six hundred twenty-seven thousand, lost right. three. They, they lost that's almost half. Third. That's more than half. You lost and half I'm, your audience. <laughs> and I was saying, I tweeted, and well, what do you think the uh, the responses from this tweet should should be? Okay, all right. So you tweeted this what you're about to tell me? Yeah. Okay. So here's my tweet. Last night or today? Last night. Okay. All right. And here the collision numbers are up too. You got them? Yeah. Yeah, kind of more even Steven, because it's really nothing Well, there's a big I drop in the mystical mystical who Tony's a humongous fan of versus mm-hmm. Angelico. Well look, but bro, like I'm saying, but look at these matches. Brian Danielson versus Shane Taylor. Right. Uh, Not the young bucks in a sick Young Bucks is a six and a six man, hmm. okay, uh, against, against a bunch of nobodies. Okay, give the name. Um, okay, a- uh, yep. Adrian, John- Adrian, Adrian Alanis. Who? John Cruz. Okay, I've heard of him. And right. Lion Adrian- Ray. Yeah. Who? By, okay, so, so bro, this is this is supposed to be one of their better shows. The, the collision is supposed to be pretty Yeah, cool. they treat this like a Saturday night main event. Remember that so, show? Bro, Brian Danielson versus Taylor, the three jobbers versus versus the costume. Yeah, Adam Priest. I guess Nick Wayne, Adam, Jer- Jer- Jericho versus Titan, right? Oof. Mystical, seriously, mystical seriously, versus- seriously. Who the f- is Titan? He's a Mexican wrestler. You well, should know Mexican that, guy. Joe. I right. know that. Yeah. I, I, I never seen him. Never heard of him. You should know <laughs> that, and you should know that Sky Boy or whatever Sky yeah. Kid is a woman. You should know. And all the that. main event was Jay Lethal, <laughs> Jeff Jarrett, and Briscoe against the House of Black, and then in, 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 in a match that really wasn't built up, and they had a street fight, right? So I'm like, you know, you're looking at this like, like, dude, like, literally, okay. If you if you have Brian Danielson, Jericho, uh, the House of Black, Nick Wayne's on the show. So of course, you know, um, uh, okay. I'm gonna say, let me let me oh, say yo. this: Disco, Disc Joe, yeah, yeah. Brian Danielson versus Shane Taylor, right? Yeah, yeah. Adrian Alanis, John Cruz, and Liam Gray versus Okada and the Young Bucks. Okay, right. Trisha Dora versus Mariah May. Okay, yeah. Adam Priest versus Nick Wayne. Uh-huh. Okay, Jericho versus Titan. Mystical versus Angelico. Jeff Jay Lethal, Jeff Jarrett, and Mark Briscoe versus House of Black. Which of those was interesting match to you? Uh, I might watch the six man because I'm, I'm, you know, I don't have much experience watching Okada. I might want to see what he's all about. I like. I'd probably watch Jericho Titan, and then maybe the main. No, now probably the mystical match. Why would you watch Jericho Titan? It's just because I'm a Jericho fan, you know. All right. Well, they're doing absolutely nothing with the yeah. guy right now. He's yeah. lost, but there's nothing there that interests me. No, like none of those. And I'm a Jericho that, fan too, but Jericho that, versus Titan does not. Titan does not. That, that's WCW Saturday Night card right there. Right. That's a Saturday Night. Right. Yeah. That's ridiculous. Right. Um. But yeah, the, like I said, I, was, I, I want to bring up that show because. Like I don't know why they don't put better matches on that show. And even though like, I don't have to say this, I am gonna say it. No hating, just stating. You know yeah. what I'm saying? 
Yeah, we're, yeah. We're, we're giving you the reasons why we don't like it. It isn't just because we don't like it. Like, like if you want me to watch that show, why am I going to make I'm it already, more interesting? I'm like, I'm watching seven hours. You've, of got, an already, overloaded, <laughs> you've got an overloaded yeah. roster, right? Bro, you should see how many people write me. And they're like, I'm losing my, uh, I don't, I don't even want to get into any, yeah. details, but a lot of people complaining that they're not being used. Right. Yeah. So I don't know. Like, Brent, like, I don't know why he likes these, these no name guys like Shane Taylor and stuff like, well, yeah. why, bro, why are these guys getting so much TV time? The biggest reason for me, the biggest reason for me to not turn on a show or give it any attention is when I look at something like that and I know who's going to win every match. You know, don't do that. So, what was the numbers on this show this week? For eight hundred one. Eight hundred one. That's all. Yeah. Wow. Remember, remember, some guy asked, "Will they get to a million or to seven hundred first? Well, they did get to a million. Joe, but oh, I, I like, I like to see the chart. Pull the chart up. I don't, I don't like this. Uh, the chart, mm-hmm. the chart is easier to follow. Mm-hmm. Okay. Because a Mercedes mode, oh, dude, this is uh okay. So let's so let's okay. They had the million. But remember, please, somebody right? asked us, will they get to a million or seven hundred? No, first? not even close. But remember that, right? Oh yeah, thank you guys. Seven hundred. You, you said a million. Disco said a million. Yeah, yeah, and I said seven hundred. I think and I'm you're, a little you're, bit closer. You're you're, you're right. Yeah, you're we're way more. Right. closer. Yeah, yeah. Um, I I actually honestly because because here's the Bro, thing. But what are you thinking? Di- okay, let's play devil's advocate, Joe. Mm-hmm. Try to explain to me why on this show that would be the main event. See if I can maybe understand. <laughs> it's so stupid. Because let me think, I don't like I don't like to use words like that. I don't want to call Tony, Tony stupid. But right. dude, you've got nine thousand people, one of your bigger T V houses in a while. Because the T V shows have been doing like two thousand three and a hot people, crowd. Right? And a hot crowd. You're in Boston. Bro, format the show like a yo, know, the way it should be formatted. You have a world championship match on the show. It should be your main event. Like this common sense, not your first match. Like what are you trying, to, bro? You're that. This just shows how clueless he is. You're literally trying to draw numbers and stuff and thing, and everything you do every week is failing. Like, look at I, what you, did, did you did you think that you would go from nine hundred thousand eight ninety nine nine hundred thousand people? The way you format the show, you would start at 900,000 and end at 627,000 people? I think we had that same problem last week, Joe. Do you remember the main event of last week? Mm-mm, but I'll look. Um, Every main event yeah, atrocious. From what you asked, have, from what you asked before, guys, yeah. From huh? what you asked before, you asked, like, try to explain that main event to you. I can't. I could right. see an, a, a reason for every, almost every other match to be the main event, except right. the one that was actually the main event. Right. So that's what... That's what throws me. So, all right, let's get to the show because I actually like the show. Did you really? Yep. Okay. Um, I, I was, I was, I, I was like, I didn't really turn off any of this stuff, right? Right. What, what I was watching, but but I, I'm going to do what I do. I'm going to be critical of some of the things. I was give my opinion. Um, but City Donate comes out. I I was not a fan. I maybe people were. I was not a fan of this promo because she spent five to six minutes, basically just she's supposed to be like the top. Like, like, let me, you know, could you imagine if Jade Cargill walked into the WWE and cut a promo like this, like talking about how, you know, when she was 13 years old, she'd take care of her brother. You know, dude, this was just a girl that, that sounded like she was marking out and kind of happy to be there and was not like, you know, presenting character work. Like her, her gimmick is supposed to be the CVO. From the first word out of her mouth, she should have like invested in that gimmick. The first six minutes of this promo were her just sitting there like, okay. yo, like marking up. But then she said, let's get down to business, huh? She said that she was there because she needed to be there and wanted to be there. And she said, AW is the only place where this revolution could be global. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's not really accurate. And Monet says she's been watching and can't wait to tear it up with everyone in the locker room. And Monet says she wants to start with the main event of Rio versus Willow Nightingale. Monet said she and Willow have a lot of unfinished business. Okay, if you're... If she said that and you don't know about the New Japan stuff, do you have any clue what she's talking about? Nope. Nothing. I agree. One Manet, million percent. B- b- Mercedes Monet is all elite, and Monet's all elite appeared on the screen, and Monet thanked Tony Khan for the tweet and told the fans watching at home to say hello to their new CEO. Then she danced in the ring with a fan chant CEO. Okay, now she's going to get the CEO chant every week. It was a good chant because you have crowd participation. But this did not sound like a promo of a girl whose gimmick is the CEO, they sound like a mark. Okay, that's my only. That's my only critical. Okay, this is what I think happened. She hasn't been in WWE. How long would you say, Joe? Two years. I think it's two years, year, right? 
Is it? I think it's only a year. Okay, well, a year. She went to it. Japan. She broke her ankle. You know, she finally gets out there. The place is going crazy. It's her hometown, so she legitimately broke down. Okay, she was raised in Boston. And oh well, it so, has been. I'm sorry, it has been two years. Yeah, there yeah. you go. So follow my thought pattern because it's like when CM Punk came back and he was all like, "Oh shucks, I missed you guys," and all this other. You know, it's like, yep. it's welcome home because that happened to me once in Mexico. I had left for seven years and I came back and I, I wasn't sure how they would respond to me and they went nuts. And I, you know, I didn't, I didn't get emotional, but it, it was, it was incredible rush. You're surprised. Yeah. And so the, here's the thing I did like the crowd loved her. The crowd was really hot for her. She looked like a star, which 90% of that place does not look like a star. Okay, uh, she took off her See, you know, uh, it would have been really nice if the commentators would explain the thing about Willow Nightingale, just like it would have been really nice if the commentators explained the thing, how how hazardous it is to count, climb my, Mount Everest for Darby Allen. That's kind of like your job. Um, yeah. And, you know, um, uh and, and bro, that's one of the problems. Even when O'Shea Jackson came on here, he was saying that's one of the problems. I don't know what is going on. I don't know who's what. And they should have explained the Willow thing. But I'm thinking my thought process is, okay, the show started off hot. This is a hot crowd. Let's see how they capitalize on this. Right. So then they you go know that this is, this is actually 12 years ago. You know what uh, WWE guy climbed Mount Everest? No. JBL. Do you really? Wow, that's interesting. Uh, that's uh, an incredible right. feat. Yeah, he he, pl- he he climbed the highest peak on each continent to help raise money for a charity he works with called the Fa- Family Center, which wow. helps needy kids in Bermuda. Wow, that but takes a, yeah, so just, a lot so of strength, Joe- endurance. Yo, what's up? I just want to thank you guys for watching this clip. Don't forget to hit the like button, leave a comment, and subscribe. And join our YouTube membership for hours and hours of exclusive, unedited uncensored content and being a member will help you get involved in our upcoming live streams uh thank you for your support thank you for riding with us i know you got a lot of other uh podcast choices be it wrestling or other ones and thank you for picking us boom